our, our kids grew up, they were actually very good at sports. They won a lot of trophies, did a lot of things, did a lot of stuff, and they played sports all the way through high school, right? They were just, in, they're, they're great, and they're so glad for the experience. But if we'd have let them play on every select team, every, every other team, everything that could have been there, something would have happened, and it wouldn't have been that our kids weren't good at sports. It would be that our marriage didn't work, or our jobs didn't work, or our families didn't work. So we had to say, hey, our first responsibility is to, be, is to be us. We have to support this family. We have to pay these bills. We have to do these things. We have to do all this. After that, we can be responsible to you and make sure that you have the foundational needs to move forward, right? And so it's, it's really, some of these boundaries just need to be, and they're not bad, and they, you know what? And ultimately, they have, they have no impact on the success or failure of those children, right? But they're, it's just that if you're not willing to look at it and say objectively, how do I be the best parent to a sports kid? And the way that we could do it was by our time and treasure and talent being limited to two seasons a year.